Hello and welcome to episode 166 of Nuggets Dungeon Terrain. This is the final episode in the series where I'm creating some clip-on magnetized wall traps. First up in this final group is the crystal trap. The crystal will be chained to a wall. It will be supported on four different points and held in the middle section. Joining this section onto the main wall section was fiddly to say the least. It took quite a few goes just to get the wires out of the way of each other and ready to line up in the correct loops. Once I got one over, it did start to be a little bit easier because it was supporting its own weight.
Next up is one of the traps that I put off right to the end. I wasn't sure how I was going to build it or how it was going to work. But then I decided the net trap could work by being attached in the center to a spear. When the spear hits its target, the weighted ends or corners continue on their path and envelop the target with the net. I use this extra thin wire to make each part of the net. Next up is a crossbow trap. This presented a couple of problems. The crossbow should probably be hidden inside the wall and therefore just making another wall with a hole in it. I wanted this one to be a little different, so instead I added a lever to the front. The crossbow continues to fire down the passageway and the giant lever leads the warriors towards it to try and switch off the trap. The catch is every time you pull on the lever, the crossbow fires again. And finally the claw cage trap. I'm going to make the cage by using this rib cage. I cut through the sternum at the front to split it open. Then I use the same thin scissors to clip off all the spaces between the ribs to make it look like each one is a sharp metal point. Running the probe down its back meant that I could split it open. While it was still hot, I was able to fuse the plastic back together in this perfect position. I then added a couple of toothpicks to where there was a couple of joins in the plastic. This will make it look like as the cage pulled you in and closed around you, it would pull you onto the spikes at the back.
thank you for joining me once again. If this is the first time that you've joined this channel, then why not go back and check out the rest of this series. The next build is well underway, so subscribe and join me for the next one.